In this video, we are going to review how to use the System Repair Disk to restore your computer from a system image created using the Backup and Restore tool in Windows 7. This is the third and final video in the Backup and Restore using a system image series. Restoring your computer from a system image restores all of the information on your computer as it existed at the time of the backup. This includes the Windows operating system, programs, and personal files and folders. Note that you cannot create a system image on one computer and restore it to a computer that is a different make and model. For example, if you have an IBM X100 laptop and a Samsung Y250 laptop, you cannot create an image of one and restore it to the other. This is because different makes and models use different drivers and other settings specific to each device. However, if you have two computers that are the same, you can image one and restore that image to the other. To begin, make sure your external hard drive is unplugged and boot the computer from the system repair disk that was created. This may require pressing a function key at startup, such as F12, the delete key, or the escape key to boot from the optical drive. The website Crafted Flash has compiled a nice list that may help you find the right function key to get to the boot menu. The link can be found in the show notes for this video. With any luck, your computer will automatically boot from the CD or DVD and the message Press Any Key to Boot from CD or DVD will appear on your screen. Press any key, such as the spacebar, to continue. The System Recovery Options window will appear. Plug in your external hard drive and then click Next. Windows will search for existing installations. If any messages appear, such as Repair and Restart, click No. When the Search for Existing Installations window closes, select Restore Your Computer using a system image that you created earlier, then click Next. The window Re-image Your Computer will appear. The scan should find the backup and the information will appear under Use the Latest Available System Image, Recommended. Click Next. Under Choose Additional Restore Options, click the checkbox next to Format and Repartition Disks. Click Next and then Finish. A warning message will appear that the restore will replace all information on the hard drive. Click Yes to continue. The restore will begin and may take several hours. Once the restore has finished, the computer will restart or can be restarted manually before the 60 second window expires. Remove the CD or DVD and click Restart Now. The computer is now restored from the system image to include Windows 7, all programs, and all personal files and folders. In this video, we reviewed how to use the System Repair Disk to restore your computer from a system image created using the Backup and Restore tool in Windows 7. The show notes for this video are available by clicking the link below the video. Please help to support HelpfulVideoTips.com by subscribing to this YouTube channel and visiting HelpfulVideoTips.com to follow along on social media. I'm Tom Sutton. Thank you for watching.